you. Continuing our team coverage, Shay O'Connor joins us now live from the North Shore where people are also seeing impacts from the stormy weather. And Shay, what can you tell us about where you are right now? I mean, lots of rain still out here on the North Shore. We're actually here at the North Shore Humane Society for Pets, where this area in particular did take a lot of water today. Take a look at this video that we were able to obtain for you today. Now, this is where about 40 animals were in their outdoor kennels before the area took in about three to four inches of rain. Now, all of the pets had to be moved to another part of the building. But let me just say this. This organization takes care of many animals that have been abused or abandoned until they can and get these animals into good homes. The water has since been pumped out of the kennels. Still, workers are worried about what will happen if the rain persists over the next two days. We've got it. We're semi keeping up with it for now, but we've had to put all these animals into our lunchroom. So we're already struggling with fosters. Our organization has 200 animals under our care at any given time. So this has kind of exasperated the situation. Now, the organization in the meantime is asking for community members like you to go ahead on and foster one of the animals for the next couple of days until they can try to keep the kennels dry. And I mean, you can find out more information about this by visiting our website, WDSU.com, including the contact number here. But for now, just reporting live from the North Shore, Shea